traffic jam in the sky. They must gain vertical separation to allow individual approaches to the target area. This is accomplished by pulling down on the front portion of the parachute, causing them to spiral in excess of 60 miles per hour. To set up a stack, one like you might see at your busy airport. At approximately 1,000 feet, these jumpers will do what is called a wind penetration check. This allows them to determine the flight characteristics of their canopy under the current conditions. The parachutes used in our demonstration are constructed of a lightweight ripstop nylon with an inherent forward speed of 20 miles per hour. Now if these jumpers want to turn left, they pull down on the left steering line. If they want to turn right, they pull down on the right steering line. And as they come in to land, you might notice that they will simultaneously pull down on both steering lines for a safe, soft landing in the target area. As the jumpers prepare to land, they will fly a downward leg, a base leg, 90 degrees to the target area, and then face into the wind for their final approach. Our first jumper is from the 82nd All-American Freefall team, flying large POW flag. Just about at this height, these people can hear you. Let's give the jumpers a big loud round of applause. Smoke. 